What's up guys, this is Brian at Full Circle Homestead. Here with a, another video. Tonight we're doing chores, it's a beautiful evening. We lost a lot of our leaves in the last two or three days. We had a bunch of rain yesterday, a bunch of wind. Knocked down most of the leaves. You can see these oak trees behind me. They still got leaves, but they're not that pretty. Barrett! Here's Barrett trying to put chickens back in for us, but he's not very good at it. So, Barrett! Well, anyways, we'll get these guys done. Good job. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. But anyways. Good job, baby. Feed these guys. After we do them, we're gonna go actually out to the where we got the cows and I'm gonna move the cows. It's been one of my one of my favorite things to do um, here in the last week or so. I just really like working with the cows. It's really fun. But we'll get out there and move them, give them some new grass. So we're down here by the cows. They've been down here right on the edge of the pond for six or seven days. We don't have water out here, so we actually just let them keep coming up and down this chute here by the pond. Oh, but look at those trees. There's the ducks here on the pond. There we go. But yeah, so they've got this, this little runway here to go in and out to the pasture. But this works pretty well. It does trample it down harder and packs it more than I would like. This fall, I'm just happy that we're actually able to get them on green pasture. I mean, this is the last week of October and we've still got probably at least seven, six or seven days of grass down here in the bottom. And this is right here by the pond and all this tall, all this dead grass here behind me Looked like this lush green pasture grass. Let's see if you can see that. I mean, you can easily see the difference here. Where they've been grazing compared to what I'm letting them graze in. So we've got fence up almost to the, this first little cluster of trees, but letting them graze there. What's up, Eddie May? When are you gonna have your baby? When are you gonna have your baby, Eddie May? When are you gonna have your baby? We're on baby watch for the cows. Nora's also pregnant, we believe. What's up, buddy? You got a date with freezer camp here in a couple more months. Let's get this pasture moved for you. Hey, Eddie May. Well, interesting uh interesting development something busted the fence i don't know if it was you tried to hop over it got tangled in it or what but the fence back there by the pond is snapped so one half is hot but i can't connect it back together to a hot line well it's a i mean it's broken so i gotta go up here to the charger um and unplug it, turn it off, and then head back out there, fix the fence, and set up a new pad. So we'll get on with that. So guys, this is where it was broken. It's broken right here on this connector. So, we gotta splice a new piece in here. We tie it back from that side to this piece. And once that's tied back together, then we can move this 
across that out probably somewhere out here and then come back to this fence and split this into two more pieces. All right guys, so I tied it together here just with a square knot and then here's the other end where I tied the two lines together and then I just tagged lined. So now we can actually set up our cross fence. All right guys, the satisfaction of a job well done. Look at the cows. They're just chowing Daddy, down. Was it there wet? It was a little bit wet. The creek bottom kind of flows into the pond <laughs> right here and it kind of goes up this side where the cows are. But got them on new grass, got them on new pasture. Guys, if you haven't, go down there, subscribe to our YouTube channel, ring the notification bell, like this video, <clears throat> leave us a comment, and as always, we'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.